Hello you guys, welcome back to Kamonica's channel. The last time we was together on this weight loss adventure, it was week 113. I had gained 5 pounds. Ugh. So I was at 188. So this will be my update. This will be week 116. And I, I had a, something I wanted to talk to you guys about, but something happened the other night and I was like, wow, that's crazy because I kind of already did a video on the topic and then it happened and I didn't want to re-record the video because I haven't edited it yet, but I didn't want to re-record the video just to insert that in there, so I figured I would talk about that kind of in this video. So... I don't care what anybody say. I've dropped five pounds. So my update is I dropped five of the pounds that I've gained, okay? Um, and I don't care what anybody say, you guys. I am obese, period. And I know a lot of people try to convince me that I'm not. You know, a lot of people be like, you're, you're plus size, you're this, you're that. I am. But at the same time, I'm obese, you know? So um, I said that the same. When you see me, I am a big girl. Somebody look, some people look at me as plus size. The world probably looks at me as obese, fat, whatever. Um, so I said all that to say, the other night when I was in class, this female was sitting on the side of me. And um, my major is in the medical field. And if you've ever worked in the medical field, then you know that you're going to talk about things like being overweight, being healthy, eating healthy, exercising, things like that. Something happened. The professor said something. And this female was sitting right on the side of me. She just so happened to be sharing my book um, because I guess she left her book or whatever. And she just came out her mouth and was like, I hate fat people. <laughs> and she said, oh my God, this, this guy used to work with me. And he was just so fat, so sloppy, and he stank so bad. One thing about me, you guys, y'all don't know, is I'm a really bold person. And normally, I'm quick. I say the, and I'll say the first thing that comes to my mind. And it's gotten me in trouble several times in the past. <laughs> um, so, yeah, I, when she said it, I think I just went into shock. You never know who wa who's watching your video. So I don't feel 100% e comfortable even talking about this because I didn't say anything dinging. You know what I'm saying? But I figured I would share with my, my YouTube family. I just had to share that with you guys. I was just so shocked that she said it. And I'm fat. I'm obese. I'm whatever. And when she said it, I think only I could hear it. Maybe one or two other people can hear it. And when she was saying it to me, <laughs> she was saying it to me like she wanted me to agree with her. Like, why would I, I'm, I'm, why would I agree with that? I don't understand. Like, why would I agree that you hate fat people? I don't hate anyone, let alone fat people. You know what I'm saying? Because I've been there, I'm there. I might not be as big as I was, but I'm there now. So I'm not going to agree with that, you know? And for her to say that to someone that's obese, <laughs> I was so shocked and I was so confused, you guys. And I just kind of wanted to share that with you guys and just, I guess just to let you guys know that you know, stay encouraged. And there's people out there that will say mean things to you, that will try to discourage you. That Everybody's not on your team. You know what I'm saying? So just stay encouraged. And when people say things, like brush it off. Even though it sh I was in shock when she said it, at the end of the day, I didn't take it personally. Cause I kind of basically gave y'all a summary, but she went on for about a minute. About how she hate fat people, how, you know, she just can't stand how some fat people um, stink and they're sloppy. I mean, I was just in shock. I think her words after like a couple of seconds of her rambling went to blah, blah, blah. Because I was in shock. Like, it shocked me, you know. 
Okay, you guys, I had to go change that shirt. I'm sitting here filming this video, and I was looking at myself. I was like, I don't like how that shirt looks, and I don't know if I'm going to keep this one on either because it's not desired as much either. So, probably going to change again. Wardrobe change mid video. Whoop, whoop. So, you guys, that was just an example of someone not thinking, you know, before they spoke and. Um, this word can be very cruel, as we all know. Um, some people say things to be mean. Some people just say things not to, I'm um, not thinking, you know. So we can't let it get to us. We just have to press on with our journeys and don't let things discourage us and all that. Just stay focused and, you know, we'll make it happen, I'm sure. Um, like I stated, you guys, I've lost five pounds. Um... I, it's not like rah rah yeah yeah you know because I've been here before so it's not necessarily like I'm ecstatic about it I'm happy that I'm losing weight but I've been here before so you know I'm just still pressing on pressing on pressing on trying to get at least 200 pounds lost I mean once I hit that goal I guess I'll be more relaxed within my journey you guys I I haven't like went back to my old ways or anything like that but I, I watch a lot of journeys you guys and I see I know it I know how easy it is to get back into your old ways lose a hundred pounds and get away well, I don't know how it feels to gain it all back but I can see how easy it would be to lose that amount of weight and then gain it all back I can see how easy it is. It is so easy to get into your own routine. You know, you're hungry, you're driving home, you haven't eaten all day, and you see McDonald's and you see Burger King, and it's so easy to go to the dollar menu and start eating, and then you do it consistently, and you look up, you gain that way back. You know, and that freaks me out. The thought of that freaks me out, and the thought of that keeps me on my journey it really truly does like that thought keeps me on my journey and I will hit a subway before I hit a McDonald's you know but I, I can see how hard it is to resist that stuff it is hard you guys to resist that stuff and I know how easy it is to just get back into your old routine it's just it's so easy you know and I just wanted to tell you guys that I go through the same struggles I've told you guys before. I want to tell you guys again because I don't think some of y'all, you guys realize it. I get a lot of different emails and things like that from you guys telling me that y'all love me. I love you too. And that um, I motivate you guys and all that other stuff. I'm going to get emotional. <laughs> but anyway, um, I just wanted to let you guys know that y'all might not know this, but I'm one person and I'm one person out here, you know, as you guys tell me, motivating you guys. I'm just one person. But imagine you have a thousand people screaming in your ear, you can do it, you can do it. Oh, <laughs> y'all don't realize how motivating that is like <laughs> y'all have no idea you guys have no freaking idea how motivating that is without this youtube channel without you guys motivate me i would not have made it this far i know i seem like i'm strong and i'm doing this or whatever whatever but without you guys it's like it's like all of this is in a bubble. My family, God, you guys, motivation, everything is in this bubble. And if you took something away from this bubble, the bubble will fall. It will burst, you know. It will fall apart. And so it's like everything, you guys motivate me so much. Yeah, I have no idea. And I, I just have to say it again. Without you guys' motivation, I would not have made it this far. I know that. I know it. I know I would not have made it this far. So I want to say thank you guys so very much for the motivation and encouragement. And I don't know what's going to happen, you know, at this point on. I can't tell you future. <laughs> but um just please continue to encourage me because I might make it look easy but it's not <laughs> anyone that's trying to lose weight for real will tell you it ain't easy no matter how easy someone makes it looks it's not easy at all by far okay 
so thank you guys so very much for coming back to Kamonica's channel I will have maybe a food idea coming up the video about um, being overweight smelly and all that great stuff I talked about some more blogs some more ideas how to things like that y'all know how I do so I'm just everywhere but I love to keep keep it interesting and don't forget you guys don't forget to enter my giveaway my huge nail and all that great stuff giveaway check that video out I'll put it as a response don't forget to enter that and I will see you guys soon I love you guys so very much peace